yellow. JSC, look at what we got today. Ooh, you already know what's up. We already shot this thing on a rabbit in the other video, but dang, son. Dang, son of a scumbang. Dang, bang. Look at this thing. This is my pistol crossbow. 30 or 40 pounds or something. This bastard shoots pretty nicely. Today we're pigeon hunting with this bastard. And look, got my metal arrows. This one's already bloody. It's been through some stuff in its life. It went through a rabbit, dude. It was a failure. This is my pigeon trap. In case my pistol crossbow misses and I lose both the arrows, I got the pigeon trap as usual. Of course that will happen is we'll end up using a pigeon trap and look at that. And we'll use the pigeon trap, stick the trail camera on, and we end up watching a couple images of my pigeons getting trapped in my live trap. We put the things down and then we eat some dang good dove breasts, pigeon breasts, whatever you're gonna call them. They're almost dang near the same thing. Let's get at them right now. Hi. That's that rabbit foot from the other video with this pistol crossbow. Check it out. Load up the crossbow. Put the sight on it. Nice. Yellow! Alright, I tried that. Uh, I lost my arrows in the abyss. Not sure if the GoPro recorded it. It's 8 degrees. I mean, the GoPro screen was all whacked out, but this is what I'm going to do right now. Until I find those arrows, if I find those arrows, we're setting the trail cam up and we're setting up the pigeon trap. What do we got here? Grumptious Dillyumptious cookie right here in my pocket. We got a cookie, we're gonna bait the trap. I'll show you what's up, I'll show you what's And the thing is way too inaccurate. Setting the trap right here. Pardon for the exposure. I mean, it's very terrible right there. I wanna set the trap right quick. Please don't snap my finger off or I will cry. Please don't snap my finger off or I will surely cry and die. So this is it right here. The camera is glitched. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stick a piece of hay inside of that so it extends it so he can touch way further. My camera's so laggy, I hope it's not the real video. I hope it's just the screen. It's so cold. Kinda seems open a, a bit more than what it used to be. Alrighty, now I'm gonna tap the thing down to where it's hanging on by like a, a little dot of metal. So it's just about ready. Dang! Gosh! That freaking scares me, dude! Oh my gosh, it's hanging on by a little dot of that circle. Help the starving pigeons. Give them a cookie. So now I'm baiting the bastard. If you snap on my hand, I will just cry or something. Please don't. <sighs> All right, now I'm gonna set the trail camera up. All righty, folks. Now, now we're gonna wait. Or we're gonna get back to the trap. We'll see if anything's in it. I'm gonna go look for my arrows. If I can't find any, we're not shooting it with that crossbow. I mean, I just had to have that crossbow because you know my last crossbow video got a bunch of views. But I mean, but I did have to have a backup trap idea. But let's see where where this thing goes. Let's see what happens. All right, let's get it. All right, I'm going up. They're on to me. Of course, because I invested all my money in arrows. What is up in the freaking roof? What the heck? Dude, I wish I had the other camera. What the frick? Guys, I wish I had the other camera. There's just an arrow up there. Guys, there's just an arrow there. That's from like two years ago when I was trying to shoot him with my bow and arrow. I was missing like crazy because it's like probably impossible with the bow and arrow because they're so fast. This is actually like a pistol and at least it, I don't have to cock it back while they fly away. But oh my gosh, there's a freaking arrow up there. That's like two years ago, dude. That's crazy. I'm going to go wait for the pigeons to strike again. Um, hopefully they quit being so skittish. I'm sure they're on me. I was shooting at them last time. This sucks. 
yellow. A couple days later, I did not have time to trap. I went home for a little while, snared some squirrels, had a good time. I catched and cooked some squirrels, but now I'm focused on them pigeons again. I got a whole bunch of arrows in the mail, a whole bunch. And this is beautiful, guys. Look at how much. I got uh, 10, 20, 30, 40. 60 arrows I have now. Now I'm gonna go up in the haymount, so I, 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 I. be using the yellow ones because I'll be able to find them in all the hay. If I use the brown ones, it'll get mixed up in freaking Holy dick, I shot him. I got him, I got him. I got him. No way. He's already dead, I think. Holy dick. No way. Look at that. Look at that. Would you look at that? Merka. Perfect shot on this boy. Perfect shot. I did it. I actually did it. I shot him with the pistol crossbow. Unbelievable. He just dropped, dude. It got him right in the vitals. He dropped. He's down, he's down. All right, I'm gonna go bring him down there and we're gonna get to cleaning him pretty soon. But I got, got a lot of work to do. We gotta deliver four cord of firewood today. Oh man, I better pick this bastard up. Oh yeah. She down. Catch and cook, baby! He's massive! Little catch and cook, baby! I bet we got our pigeon, we got our catch and cook, baby! I'm gonna go out... I'm gonna freaking go out. We're gonna uh, try and get that wood sorted out, and I'm gonna let this bastard sit. I don't like dealing with them while they're freaking warm. Kind of feels weird. Kind of feels weird when you're gutting them and you're warm. I mean, it's a little freaking disturbing, if you know what I'm saying. But other than that, we got them right in the sights, baby. Right in the sights, mother truckers. I don't know if you can see the little red dot. Little pistol crossbow action, unbelievable. I didn't, I did not think we were finally gonna pull this one off. I mean, it was negative 25 last night, or negative 35. I think it was negative 35 degrees last night. It ended up clearing up to seven degrees. Pretty warm out here. Honestly, it feels really warm after last night. And now uh, I see three pigeons roaming around. Took a little scoping action at this baby and went. Wow. Got him. He dropped an instant, instant death. Instant humane, humane, very good death. All right, I gotta go to work. Oof, I can't drop my camera. <laughs> Pardon, but, but that's like disrespectful, but I mean that, that sounded funny. I mean that, I mean that sounded funny, low-key funny. As we scroll through the hidden sea scrolls, you know, it's just that kind of lighting vibe. We look at the pit. 
Oh, what the hell? Yellow! All right. This is actually a good uh, day and a half later after the kill. And, well, I, I got to process the bastard today. Um, I woken up at, like, what, 9 and then worked till one in the morning. We actually sent her a little too hard tonight. Play that video. That. Yeah, we got her freaking trailer stuck in the ditch. And play that picture. Yep, I freaking uh, flew over my snowmobile. Stay tuned, we're gonna have some sledding videos soon. But look at that bastard, dude. The process the pigeon right now. Heck, couple of days this should be cooked up on a grill but other than that you know i'm just trying to get it done tonight it's one in the freaking morning you know I've, i put in a long hard days of twerk you know what i'm saying got rigor mortis dude no balls Alrighty, folks, I'll get to when my sister cooks up this. More than likely, she'll cook it up. That has to be the least appetizing meal I will ever eat on this channel. That looks absolutely horrendous. Uh... <laughs> Ooh, I don't even know how to start this off, dude. I'm sorry, folks, but it's been like five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty-three days since I made that pigeon video. We just finally cooked the bastard. I'm sorry, dude. I literally don't remember where where I left off. I don't even know how to finish this video. Generally, I got you know a real cool vibe with me when I while I wean out my video, but <clears throat> I have no clue as in where in the shell what I was doing. <clears throat> I don't got my other light with me, so it's not looking real LED cool. But I do got that deal. <laughs> I'm, I'm goofy. Stop it. Get some help. I thought, but look at that juicy McNugget. Oh my gosh. Dude, dude, my sister cooked this up. Wrapped her up in bacon. You already know I didn't cook it. I'm too dumb. But wrapped her up in bacon. Little cream cheese. Let's eat this thing. Let's see what it tastes like. Oh. Mmm. Ooh. Little spicy. Every time. Oh my gosh. <laughs> she told me it's not spicy. She says there's never seeds. I'm thinking there's seeds in there. <sighs> there's seeds. I know there is. That dang up spicy. Mm. Oh my gosh, that tastes so good. That's a real popper right there, bud. That's a real popper. Mmm. Mmm. That's a real jalapeno popper right there if I ever eaten one. I recommend you all go out to your Hamo, your silo, you shoot a pigeon and you give her a try. I mean, you think, ah, so dude, it tastes wonderful. That tastes honestly so good. Thanks for watching this video. Why not hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and maybe even comment down below like, you filthy rascal. That's the word of the day. You filthy rascal. You are a bigot. That's the words of the day. Am I a bigot? No. But your dad, I'm gonna call me one because I done shot a pigeon with a pistol crossbow. <laughs> Do you hear me? That's enjoyable, very good food. Subscribe! Yeah!